Darwin, please give us your opening statement. There's no guiding hand behind nature. Life changes gradually, species evolve as they respond to their surroundings. And yet, Mr. Darwin, does the eye not speak of purpose? Its precision implies a designer, not blind chance. It's not chance, it's gradual improvement. Complex organs evolve step by step, no creator needed. But improvement implies direction. Who gives nature its compass? No compass, only survival. Traits that help survival are passed on. That's it. But can mere survival explain the harmony of life, the heart, the bee, the laws of physics? You're mistaking utility for design. Natural pressures sculpted these features, not divine plans. Then explain the irreducible complexity. Half a wing is useless. How does that evolve? Wings didn't appear fully formed. They started as structures for gliding, balance, whatever helped. Every stage served a purpose. You replace a watchmaker with randomness. That's faith in chaos, not reason. No, it's evidence. We've traced patterns across species through time, consistent, testable, and grounded in the natural world. Still, no fossil ever showed a monkey becoming a man. Your theory requires faith, too. It requires patience, not faith. Time builds wonders over millions of years, not six days. And yet, your wonders lack meaning. Design gives us purpose. Evolution strips it away. Purpose is something we invent, not inherit. Nature doesn't owe us meaning. Then I pity your world, sir. Beautiful, yet blind. And I question yours. Orderly, but unproven. Gentlemen, time is up. Thank you both.